Kids are often told not to play with their food. But their parents must not have ever met David Fort. Yeah, they must not have. So you'd never think when you first see him, but Fort, who is the co-owner of the Meat and Place in Web City, has a very special talent. Everyone thinks I'm crazy. And I have too much time on my hands. I'm going to carve a rose in this watermelon. I started this just as a hobby a while back. First one? Not so good. I threw that one away and started over. Melons are one of the easiest mediums to do, so it's softer. And it seems the smaller fruit you do, the harder it is, because it's you got to be more detailed and precise. My biggest fan is my grandson. He won't eat a watermelon now without having a flower on it. So I don't know. I just enjoy making stuff look good and have people appreciate it. So it's worth the time doing. We do them for uh, uh, special events, bridal showers, wedding receptions. Uh, I've carved honeydews, cantaloupes, apples. Uh, do some interesting things with onions. It's part of making food look good. I say it has to look good to taste good. So there's your basic rose.